What's up, guys? Pet Man here, Carolina Varsity, taking a look at another conference game here in the Mecca Conference. You got Hopewell traveling over to Huff, and uh, Hopewell's coming off a 41-18 loss to Davie County. Huff's coming off a 35-3 loss to Butler, so both teams looking to bounce back, get in the win column here. Uh, keys vic to victory for both teams. For Hopewell, their execution has got to be better. Um, looking at their game against Olympic, they had turnovers in the red zone that held them back. Um, you know, we kind of felt like against Davie County that they could uh, have a shot in winning that game, and they kind of got blown out. So, Coach Gray's got to, you know, keep the ship going, uh, keep everything positive, um, go back and fine-tune those errors, and, um, you know, get the offensive efficiency going because that's going to help the defense out. Um, they got to find a way to create turnovers on defense to help that offense out also. Um, you know, against Huff, you know, I, I was impressed with their offense despite them losing 35-3. to I thought they were in place. They, they knew what they were doing. Uh, they were just facing a real good defense in Butler. And um, they've got guys, I like the quarterback Gibbs, and I like Osborne. They use them all over the field. Um, they they got to find a way to get pressure on Gibbs because if you let him sit back there and throw it, he he looks like he can, you know, kind of slice the defense up if you give him time. Uh, for Huff, they got to create big plays on offense. A lot a lot of their, their plays are exec executed well. I like the way they set up things. Um, but they, they're missing that big play element. I think that can take them over the top. And I mentioned that, you know, in my uh, recap of the Butler Huff game. Uh, so they find a way to create big plays on offense. I I would try Osborne on the outside at receiver and let him make plays in space. Receiver screens, if you get him one-on-one -on -one situations, let him go get the ball. Uh, things like that. They also use him in the Wildcats. So I like a lot of the things they're doing. But if they get that big play element uh, in their offense, I think they're going to be real tough you know, to stop. On paper, you like Huff here. They're four and one. Hopewell's kind of struggling a little bit. Uh, but Hopewell has played, you know, good teams tough. They played Mooresville tough. Um, obviously, they beat Garinger week one. Um, they played Lake Norman tough. So, you know, if Huff comes in in this game, you know, expecting Hopewell to lay down, they could be in a dog fight. But I, I don't think Coach Aldridge is that type of guy to let that happen. Uh, those Huskies will be ready to go. They're at home. They're eager to get back on the field after losing the Butler last week. So I uh, hope you guys have a safe ball game. Uh, thanks for watching.